Well guys, I did a thing. I bought a 2016 Ram Rebel 4x4. I've now got the 99 Ram listed for sale. That happened today. But when I got it home, uh, I realized that there's a hitch already on it. And I don't need that hitch. I need that one for my trailer. So I called the dealer, he does not have the key to that. So I'm doing the next best thing, taking some yellow things, sticking it in a yellow thing. I'm gonna see how many blades it takes to cut off. It's a locking pin, so let's get after that. That's the very first project on the truck. Gotta customize my hitch apparently. Jeez, what a mess. Blade number one. What? Not doing it wrong. Apparently, need one more yellow thing. I literally thought that would take more than one blade. Well, that blade's impressive. That's not even been in there very long. It still has all the stickers on it. I really thought that would take way more than one blade. I debated on buying two of the five pack blades. But this thing. Wow, and it still has quite a bit of teeth left in it. I jammed it into the ground and bent the blade pretty nastily there at the very end, but I don't even care. I was expecting to use five blades and maybe go to the store for more. So that's done. Now I can get the real hitch on it. Hitch up to the trailer, take that thing for a little test spin to see how the new truck does. Tony. I've been dreaming on in my head like I've seen it A life worth living is a life with meaning I'll do what I love till my heart stops beating I'm feeding this demon Got a taste and a waste bitterness in my face Work a job every day till your dreams fade away Like a card never change, play the game Now we say, I need a break Time to stay strong, need to move on to be what I want I'll keep dreaming on Time to stay strong, need to move on to be what I want I'll keep dreaming on That is not a bad looking setup. I've got the air ride suspension at the absolute lowest setting. I just kind of wanted to see how things settled with the trailer attached. There's no real weight in the trailer, uh, no water, no gear loaded up or anything like that, no gear in the back of the truck, but I wanted to see what the ride height would look like with it low in case I needed to adjust the hitch. But it looks like it'll be all right. We won't ride with it that low, it'll actually be up at least one air ride setting. There's four total on that, which is pretty friggin' sweet but I get so fast forward several months and we've been on several trips towing with the new truck and it is fantastic we can set cruise control we can have the air conditioner on uh, and just cruise uphill whatever it doesn't even doesn't even phase it we are in love we did not have that as an option with the 99 dumb dog recording a video here if you're looking for a new truck and you're looking at a Ram Rebel, I I give it a big old thumbs up. Uh, I've had it for several months, like I said, and the only thing we really miss in it is dual climate control, like I've said before. All the other features, it has everything we've ever asked for. So, thumbs up. If you think I've deserved it, give this video a thumbs up. And subscribe, we've got lots of projects in the works. If this is the first time to the channel, welcome. This is Troy with Troy's Garage. We'll see you in the next video.